like last week I forgot to hit the record button, so we're going to miss that whole intro again, but that's okay. How is everybody? Mike's not live. My mic is live. What are you talking about? All right, I don't believe you, Powers. I don't believe you. Right. Right. <laughs> oh, I see what happened. Oh, jeez. I... Hey. All right, there we go. I fixed that. Yeah. Certified sleepy babs. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you guys, how is, you guys, mics are now officially live. Apparently, there was a bug. I had the wrong audio device selected. Um, failure. Yeah. You're a failure. Let's, uh, <laughs> appreciate that. Birdie, how was your week? You get to go first. Try, try um, hard again. Well, you know, uh, I've binged a lot of TV, so that's been fun. I started a new series like yesterday, I'm halfway through it. Me and Cam, my roommate, are going to watch more of it tonight. So, really riveting. I got to do a little bit of drawing, which was nice. Um, but outside of that, I'm chilling. Quarantines, you know, it is what it is. Uh, I may have made a boo-boo today. I took a walk and was lured in by the local children's playground, which nobody was at. Decided to go swinging on the monkey bars. I washed my hands immediately after, but I still did it. <laughs> So here we are. But uh, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. Things are good. <laughs> okay. Awesome. Christian, what are you up to, bud? Oh, man. Uh, I was just telling Natalie this, but my <laughs> three-year-old brother is back from the Philippines. So we're all taking this time to spend time with him. And we're already teaching him how to play certain video games. It's So he's having fun. He still runs on a Filipino sleep time, though. So he's like, out cold right now in the living room. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's fair. Jet lag is real. That's like a sixteen hour difference or something, right? Yeah. That's wild. It do be crazy. Like, right. It's around like mm-hmm. Oh. Oh, frozen. Oh, you're back. Thank God. I thought you got frozen by Mr. Freeze or something. Oh me? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You're back. Oh, you're back. okay. Okay, um, cool. That's what matters. Yeah, no, that's good. My week was normal. Um, I'm essential. So I've been working <laughs> every day so far. Um, my life effectively Game. hasn't changed. Um, GameStop's essential. Ooh. <laughs> GameStop, the controversy. Yeah, I, oh, God. Let's not talk about this mm -hmm. right now. Hey, somebody has okay. to give people their fucking Animal Crossing. That's Yo, true. honestly. That's true. Doesn't that come on digital download, though? Mm -hmm. it, okay. It can. That's an option. That's an option. Um, you just gotta go to GameStop and get it, though. Oh, fair. All right. Whatever. Go ahead, GameStop. Kill everybody. I don't care. Uh oh. Um. Oh. So we've got a lot going on on this show. Excuse me. A lot on the show this week, even though it wasn't a very busy week. Um. We're gonna be going over a little bit of the top ten because some places did get some games in before everything was shut down. Um, we have a conversation about Hell's Bells. That's a game that everyone loves. Ooh, we have uh, new icons for the chat. I guess I can go over that right quick now. So if you go into the chat, boom, ch 2 ick you can spread your own version of the ick. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't give anybody oh. the ick. Or give everybody Don't the ick. Don't do it. Don't get the ick. Don't the give the ick. Go spread that ick on the other yeah. things. Yeah. Fireman. <laughs> nice. Right. Already sending out one ick. <laughs> exactly that. one ick. Yeah, we oh. have... Uh, also on the show today, we've gonna have we's gonna have yeah we're gonna have uh, we're gonna have a discussion with the with with the everybody. So I'm gonna take some people uh, from the Discord. I'm gonna go ahead and spam that right now in the chat. Uh, join up on the Discord if you wanna come in and talk with us. In the second half, we'll uh, let anybody come in and talk. Probably at the end of Hell's Bells, we'll start grabbing oh, people. That's, that's a lot of ick in the chat, y'all. That's a lot of ick. I like it. 
Yo, Owl, are you good? Like, all that ick is saying something. <laughs> Owl's got that ick, bro. He does. Uh, we have another video. Um, this one's direct from iCombat. A uh, little bit of a little bit of a, a teaser for when all the stores will open up again. So it'll be fun. A little something something for later. Heck yeah, they're <laughs> gonna open up again. Yeah, not as not as early as we hoped. Um, I'm trying to shoot things. Like... Right. Why is my camera so dark today? Right, you guys talk for a second. I want to fix this. You kind of look like you're sitting in the void. <laughs> oh, that's honest so though. Oh man, that hit. <laughs> that hit. It's <laughs> 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 just all the lighting. It's like. I <laughs> really <laughs> likes the ache. Yo. Right. Speedy, yeah. I can confirm Al is not good. I'm like. Anytime uh, somebody is sick, even outside of this, we're just ick in the chat. <laughs> yeah, just icks in the chat. No Fs. We're not effing for anybody. It's icks. Yeah. Icks in the chat. <laughs> we were playing a good game of Scribble IO earlier, so like. Yeah. I still haven't jim jumped in on a single one of those games, and I really need to. But every single time you guys do one, I am in the middle of a very important binging. <laughs> episode i think so. really important is kind of wait i i could have sworn you were in a game with us one day like you i won't game. have i won't have any other time except for literally the other week and a half i have left of quarantine well technical <laughs> quarantine like with no school That's so fine. i don't see how i could squeeze in what i'm doing at any other point <laughs> all right moving on <laughs> Um, so, <laughs> we do have some top 10s, so we're going to switch the scene and do some top 10s this week. These are not official top 10s. These aren't going to count toward the full leaderboards. Uh, reason being, most of the locations weren't open this week, so no point in giving people a leg up just because uh, state governors were too slow to react. It is... <laughs> it's the quarantine scoreboard. That's what we're calling it. Yes. Oh, man. <laughs> Indeed. So we got Chicago here first. Uh, I think they only played Thursday this week. Oh, no, Wednesday <laughs> and Thursday. Wednesday, the spring break. Uh... Yeah. The, the it's all the children session. on here. Yeah. So we got uh, 10th place. I I O I O Walani. I O Walani with 2,400 points. That's a brand new player. Uh, ninth place, well, we can buy sleep with 3,600. Eighth place, 10K with 3,900. 7th place, Killer Cobra, 4,500. 6th place, Weffy with 6,000. 5th place is Out with 6,300. 4th place is Ben Big Mac, 8,100. 3rd place, Speedrunner, 8,200. 2nd place, Tiberius, 8,700. And 1st place, Joe Rebel with 11,000. Dad mm -hmm. coming in hot for the fucking win. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Joe Rebel is on it. <laughs> yeah, that that just kind of smells like a a pub stomp. <laughs> yeah. Um, he uh he came in during quarantine and yes. he said we are not playing games here. <laughs> Dropping the lockdown. If you shall. I played with him on I played with him on Thursday. He was on his A game. Uh, that one. It was Man's hard to like. It was yeah, hard to make point. a move with him there. <laughs> true story. True story. Um. All right. So, yeah, that's about it. I mean, like I said, these aren't going to go on the weekly continual top ten because we're not going to do that till all locations are open again. But there you go. Uh, that's Chicago. Uh, this Yay. is this is Madison. This is Madison. Okay. They had, okay. Okay. They had some. They had. They had some sessions going nope. on. Nope. Yeah. It's a. It's a blank. Blank page. It's a blank page. Blank oh, page. Nothing on Madison. I am. I am watching <laughs> nope. the blank page. <laughs> so good job to Madison. You guys closed first. I appreciate that. Nice job. All good right. Guys. Good job on keeping everyone safe. Yeah. Good job yeah. prioritizing everyone's safety. Keep the fucking ick out of here. Yeah. Get the Ain't got no place over here. Ick, ick, what do we got? What uh, do we got? Up oh, is, uh, Michigan. Michigan stayed open. It looks like for I think one or two extra days. <laughs> I think they closed down on Friday. Mm -hmm. Um, but over there mm -hmm. we got okay. 10th place was Topher 8300, 9th place our boy Thermit the Frog 10,000 
eighth oh. place Score is was... already like tripling ours. Yeah. Uh, stop whiz. Even <laughs> during this time, they're still yep. Yeah. Feels bad. And that's only fifty nine kills with ten thousand points. That's wild. Right. Uh, seventh place, Tyler with eleven thousand. Sixth place is Black Attack with eleven thousand. Fifth place is John Wick. John Wick plays at y'all location. Damn. You guys let John Wick play? Uh, That's uh, fucking wild. Oh, does he, okay. Does he bring his dog? <laughs> the real does question. Because like I ain't cool bring... with that. Oh, I'm cool with that. I'll pet the dog. I'm trying to. That's fair. He would like you. Just don't kill his dog. No, nah, mm -hmm. I wouldn't dare, because then we got, we got worse problems. Right. All right John Wick had uh, 13,000. Fourth is Death Mechanic. Uh, 13,000 there. Third place was Lord Chanka. <laughs> Lord Chanka, 13,000. That's a great name. That's incredible. Uh, second place, Golden Grizz. 22,000 and first place, Methamaro, our five-star leader with 24,000 points. Look at him. Not sacrificing any points for the ick, I see. Get your ass inside. Yeah. <laughs> Safest place to be. Right behind the gun. The mm. Golden Golden Grizz? I thought it was Golden Girls with a Z at the end. I'm going to oh. be honest. When I first Golden said Girls? <laughs> that would be so like, badass. Betty White was in there I would... dropping fucking lead on people. Absolutely. Oh, yeah. Betty White don't play no games. Are you joking me? She would light them gonna... motherfuckers mm -hmm. up. Mm -hmm. Betty White would be in that bitch. Watching Golden that Girls. show. <laughs> Golden Girls is so funny. <laughs> and our last location. It's like someone from Waukesha snuck in and played a three on three. Hey, Ooh. look at that. JK, JK, that's cool, bro. That's Old cool. Man Gilly. Rockin on. <laughs> you know what this looks like? This actually looks like it was probably a uh like a employee game or something right before they closed up. Maybe. Or just whoever. I don't was know there who their employees the are, so well, we got I was gonna say I had... I don't. Dubai? Huh. Blazing Redhead? Mm. Well, I mean, you can put whatever city you want for your home location. No, I know. I just think it's funny. Yeah, it is funny. That's so, true. Old Man That's Gilly, Blazing true. Redhead, Frog Champ, Delirium, Unicorn Rage, and Turtle. Congrats to oh. you folks. I hope that we get the locations open again in a safe time. Not soon. Yes. Yes. A safe time. <laughs> like, at least like a month. But <laughs> yeah, let's take a little while. Let's make sure everyone gets healthy. Show up to work in a hazmat suit, bro. I forgot. To drink water. Birdie, birdie. I'm dying. <laughs> <laughs> I need an ambulance. <laughs> ambulance. <laughs> okay, I'm fine. <laughs> you need an ambulance. <laughs> <laughs> oh lord, hey lord, hey lord, hey. Oh Jesus, there's a fire. <laughs> All right, so, so I'm gonna leave this. I'm gonna leave this next uh this next thing up to the chat. We're gonna go for 60 seconds only. Most votes wins. Do you guys want to go on to the uh the discussion of Hell's Bells, or do you guys want to go <laughs> oh, on to God. the uh, video that I have to show? Starting now. 60 seconds. Ooh, hurry up and vote. Comment a pee, a video so or Hell's Bells? Uh, okay. <laughs> one video, two video. What is one? Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, everyone's in. Oh, okay. Three video. Video for three for video. Okay, okay. We could talk about Hell's Bells. We all know the game later. So like <laughs> four video. Oh, what? All right. All right, 30 seconds. Any more votes? All right, looks like the videos are winning. By the way, All we right. do have stream notifications now for subs and for follows and for bit things, so things will pop up and do wacky shit, if you will. Breaking my own rules about swearing right there. By the way, in this little interlude... Okay, so we're going to do the video next. We're going to wait for Birdie to come back after she uh, stops trying to choke herself. Um, <laughs> but what we're going to do is...
Hey, look at that. It just popped up on the screen. Power's donating some bits. Thank you very much, sir. We appreciate it. Um, what we're going to do is uh, we'll look at the video. Uh, we'll talk about the video. It's about a minute long, about 40 minutes, 40 seconds or so. Um, and then we will uh, we'll see what's going on. So I want Birdie to see it, so I'm going to wait for her to get back. In the meantime, I hope everyone's been keeping themselves busy during yeah. the quarantine, staying home, everything. Just stay safe Absolutely. out there. Only go out if you need to buy something at a grocery store. Or your copy of Animal Crossing. Correct. <laughs> Correct. Throughout this whole thing, I've only been outside the house like twice, I believe. So, I'm gonna go ahead and spam the uh, socials in the chat again so that people can. Spam the social. Oh, so if they want to be in if the. If they want to be in the discussion a little bit later, you can jump on and uh, you can join us in there. Oh man, everyone's going to be. Everyone's going to be hopping on. I hope so. It'd be nice to catch up with everyone, see what everyone's up to. Absolutely. Then again, a huge majority of everyone's already on our Discord. And we talk to each other, like, basically true. every day anyway. Yeah, Discord's been popping off lately, especially with everybody home. We've mm -hmm. got uh, voice channels for people to gather and talk. We've got a lot of people that play Warzone. Uh, we've got a lot of people doing just general gaming stuff. Uh, people have been playing Scribble IO. Mm -hmm. uh, people posting memes. We've oh yeah, had, the memes have been going yeah, off. Yeah, it's 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 a pretty good time. Uh, what else has been going? Oh yeah, there's. You are, you already said there's there's chat rooms for every map, every mm -hmm. location. But we all, and you will never go lonely. In Warzone, you will always have a squad, yes. regardless. So. Speaking of Warzone, yesterday was probably my best day of playing Warzone ever. Wait, which day? Yesterday. I, uh, I yesterday. played with Fabian and BJ, and we, oh, okay, okay. we did back-to-back -back wins. So we won, we won, then we finished and like, we got knocked out pretty quick, and then we came back and we got a second place. So we went win-win, the second. That's good though. That's good. Yeah. I, I for one, too. she's all right. Only have one win under my belt. <laughs> really? Yeah. I'm not that great a Call of Duty player. So it's hard to win. Um, I mean, you need a good chunk of luck to actually win the last uh, win the last game or with the last mm -hmm. circle. I just like to... Hey, there she is. It's always good to... Oh, hey, there she is. I was going to say, it's always good to yeah, complete contracts to like see what the next circle is. I like to stack on those. Right. And and like that way, like the more info you get on where to be, the better it is to position yourself. Mm -hmm. Hey, 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 oh. Hold on, she's almost back. Hey, there she is. Hello, I've returned. Hey, I apologize. She has returned. Did you survive, or what happened there? I did. I just went to the bathroom. I talked to Cam for a couple minutes, and then I realized my phone was dying, so I got my charger. <laughs> oh, that's important. Yes, we'll bet. We'll bet. Good. All right, so everybody voted for the video. Mm. So I hope this comes across well. I mean, that makes sense. Um, We're hoes for drama around here. Yes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to transition over. I'm going to mute our mics. We're going to watch the video, and then we'll come back and we'll talk about it. You guys both watched the video already, right? Yes. No? You didn't watch the video, Christian? What would what you say? He's going to be surprised. What would you say you do around here, buddy? Stop. He naps and takes care of his brother. Right. Okay. Uh, yeah. leave, leave the man alone. We're going to get the consultant. I like right? naps. I do like my nap. Like All right, we're getting muted, and we're going to watch this video. We'll be back in about a minute.
There you go. Oh, that's right. your video. That was pretty cool watching for the first time. That's the motherfucking T. Yeah. So that is real life action of the IR saw. Mm -hmm. The IR. I think that All looks right. pretty cool. I think it's pretty snazzy myself. For a person who's always looking for something else to do at high combat, <laughs> um, that looks pretty. That looked pretty amazing. Uh, it has a bipod. Can we just talk about that for a second? Like, what is that? Oh you man, that way you're not having to lift edge? that thing all the time. Yeah. It would be Oh, great. like, I got you. Okay. Yeah, so it's like, got a little, little tripod. It's a bipod. Yeah, bipod. That's, un that's okay. <laughs> all right, look at that. All one. right. <laughs> then it uh, looks like it's not too difficult to walk around with. I mean... I mean, it looked like they were doing this, it just fine. We're going to let this play again here. Like, mm -hmm. he's not struggling to move with that thing at all. It's a little big, but... Right, 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 right. That was filmed, obviously, at Madison's Field. Yes. Um, Good old Camp Leatherneck. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I think the coolest part about it is you don't have to reload. As long as you yeah, don't overheat. Yeah, you don't have to reload, a... but there's a cooldown period. Well, yeah, if you if you go too hard on the trigger, it'll lock up for a second. But I have a feeling, though, that, like... Even it, like, because I guess. By the way, I guess in my oh, head, ahead, people sorry. are just like spamming the trigger on something like that. So, regardless, you're probably going to have a lot of cooldown. <laughs> right. Oh, ah, it's on YouTube. Spoilers. <laughs> Yikes. Um, so, that oh. video <laughs> was sent over to us by, um, by Megan out at the iCombat Corporate. Um, that is a, a video that hasn't even been posted off to their, their corporate buyers yet. So that's not even, this is like pre-launch material that we got. We're kind of a big deal. Regulars first. Oh Thank man. You. Thank you very much to the iCombat folks for letting us spoil that. We appreciate it. Thanks iCombat. Feed, feed the beast, if you will. We <laughs> feed the beast. content. Yeah, no, that looks really fun. I can't wait to get to play with that. Um, I'm going to chase that across wherever field it's at, too. I'll go anywhere. I feel like that would be really interesting to use on Alcatraz upstairs. Oh, no. You think about that? <laughs> like, set up at the top of the staircase and just... Oh, down. Man. absolutely, baby. You wouldn't be able to get upstairs. Who? What? With the gun? No, no, no. I mean, like, once you're up there, you just keep burst firing and nobody can ever come upstairs. Uh, and that's period yeah. exactly a, accuracy of point zero one percent i mean no. you could <laughs> you could stand at the wall like if you let's say you're coming from um intake you could just stand on the the right side of the wall and just chill out like right in that spot where you can see the stairs and see right by the wall and just piece people out and i suppose you can do that fire. anyway but you could do it without much of a break mm -hmm. and mm. without really yeah. holding your gun <laughs> fair oh man that's nasty i don't like it <laughs> i would imagine that it's for the trigger happy people since they don't have to reload they just have to burst fire i imagine sure. the concept of sniper would be pretty Ooh, yeah, oh yeah yeah, it'll be rough on people. Basically useless. It's gonna be I... interesting though when you go like one versus one because it is four shots to kill with that thing. Uh -huh. Oh, true. So well, I don't know if it. That's if it's... only one more than usual though. True. Like... No, it's very true. But it could be a big difference. I'm like top tier Honestly, playing. Honestly. I feel like the big difference is really where it's going to come in, where it's like you've been using the gun too much and you get to that cooldown section and you've only got two shots in or yeah. three and you just end up missing that fourth one because... It locks you up know. on you. Exactly. Yeah. And I have a hunch that like it's probably like played down more than it actually is like when you play with it because I, I feel like they're not just going to give you a semi or an automatic weapon without some type of real like delay because that just seems unfair if you're playing on a field with mostly M smgs and possibly a shotgun right okay. i'm still in the party of where the pistol's at <laughs> that'd be hot 
It sounds yeah. like so much fun. It is. That's the real Maybe team. We'll find out one day if the world stops coronaing and we can actually get back to playing. I mean, they yeah. already <laughs> exist. Like locations have them. Why yeah. don't we? Um. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I know, like the basic reason why we don't have them, but. Uh, I mean, the basic reason is because they're pushing the Gen 3 equipment. Right. Because uh, Gen 2, I don't think, is supported anymore. So. Mm -hmm. Anyways. Right, 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 right. Um, I just messaged in the Discord. If you guys do want to join us during our Hell's Bells discussion, go ahead and join the audio chat, the voice channel for uh, gear swap discussion. Or Come broad streaming me, live. Baby. And then the as I see people fine. join in there, we'll uh, we'll get you on the chat here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so it is open now. If you'd like to join us, go ahead, because we're going to start talking Hell's Bells in a second here. Get on in here. A highly competitive game. Very simple to get. Scooch that boot. Yep, we got a couple seconds of of BS to talk about here. So if you guys want to fill for a second, I just got to change <laughs> the scene around. And then I don't know what to talk about but, other than sitting at home is starting to get me real right. antsy. I fixed it. We're good. This, hmm. All right. Um. Oh, hey, look, how's Bells? Okay, cool. Yeah, we <laughs> are. I did it. It, just, it only took me a second. Mm. I just wanted to. Congratulations. I just a quick, a quick moment to hide some stuff. Ah. All right. So we've got a Hell's Bells discussion. Um, who wants to go over the rules for this one? Don't look at me. I mean, I'll do it if you don't want to. Yeah, sure. Go for it. I'm not a team leader, but I'll try. <laughs> you you run the game. You you are literally the person who projects the rules onto the TV for other people to read. That's fair. I do. <laughs> I do do that. I do do that. <laughs> all right so hell's bells for all of the new people out there that may be watching this for the first time on the internet hell's bells is a team game it is not kill based the objective of the game is to get to the bell on whatever respective map you are on shoot directly into the bell from the bottom every time you hit the bell you'll get a point most points wins the bell location in alcatraz is in the top center guard tower on Shanty, it's down the middle hallway, right in the middle. In the middle. It's usually <laughs> in the middle. Stuck in the middle with you. Um, it is <sighs> on Madison's Field. It is underneath the... Uh, in between the two guard towers. So there's an actual bell tower there. You can check it out there. Um, over on Waukesha's map, I believe it is down the alleyway on the far side of the map and then michigan is dead center in the middle of the field also in a guard tower much like madison all right that's it all right that's that on that respawn only at your base unlimited lives most points wins that is correct um basic strategies what are you looking to do birdie when you play hell's bells win if you're to phrase that, if you're teaching a new player what to do, oh Waukesha's mm -hmm. in the market. I apologize. Waukesha's in the market. I apologize. Um, if you're teaching a new player, Birdie, what are you gonna tell them to do on Hell's Bells? Um. Wow. Uh, I'm just trying to think about what I do, and generally. It's hope to God you have players on your team that know what the fuck they're doing and then go for the bell. Because <laughs> I feel like a lot of times it's e really easy to end up in situations where you're at least one of the few or one of the only players who gives a fuck about ringing the bell. Because <laughs> like sometimes games, especially like Hell's Bells, just end up in... I don't give a fuck. I'm not going to do that. I just want to get kills, which is like very common for a lot of actual like um I'm forgetting the word right now, trying to find it in my brain. Uh it's on the tip of my tongue, but it doesn't really matter. Objective games. Got it. He <laughs> um objective games is like a lot of people are going to ab abandon the objectives even if you're regulars and still go for kills cuz they still count for points even if it's an objective game. Um, but 
I think, like, first things first, like, if you're in Shanty, it's cover the middle hallway, both ends of them, regardless of which spawn you're on, because if you're in either one of them, you're going to want to have somebody in that back corner that looks down directly the um, the full length of the middle hallway, um, and then have somebody who's willing to die over and over and over and over and over again to get points, which is pretty much the same on Alcatraz, except for you don't look down a hallway, you run upstairs. So you want to have people who can cover you upstairs. And generally the people who are going for the bell are going to be people who are willing to die over and over and over again to get points. <laughs> Unless you have people upstairs who are dedicated to protecting you, which is few and far between, I feel like. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, Christian, what's your, uh, what is your shout out to the new people? What are you telling them to do? My shout out to the new people, to everyone playing Hell's Bells for the first time, is don't lose your mind on the objective if you die a lot. The only reason they're trying to make sure you don't get to the bells because they know, obviously, you're trying to win the game. They, people always pray for when people forget about the bell, they give up on it and then just decide. I'm just going to kill people, make sure they don't get to the bell, so that way the rest of my team does it. It's like, like you said before, it is a team effort. If one person doesn't go for the bell, that's, you know, that's kind of like one less person to ring a bell when you need it. So just like, don't get discouraged about dying a lot. Just keep going for the bell. And another thing that's really, really common, someone would always walk up to me, and ask me where the bell is. If you need to know where the bell is, <laughs> obviously I'm going to help you if you didn't get it the first time. So, right. like, to, so I would just say try to remember where the bell is, and if you need help on where the bell is, ask a team leader or a regular where the bell is. We do not right. mind telling you. I will literally take you there myself, shoot everyone in the way, and tell, the, and tell you to shoot the bell for five minutes straight. I've definitely been asked more than once by new people who are playing where's the bell even after team leaders being like the bell is in the dead center of the map if you look up you can't miss it it literally doesn't matter if they're not listening they're not listening <laughs> yeah yeah personally as a team leader i have had to take my new players of the team to the bell and be like hey if you want to win shoot that it's right there <laughs> Yeah, you have to be pretty obvious sometimes. Um, my my tip for new players uh is usually if I get up to the bell and there's people that are there that are new, you tend to get a clump of people, like five people trying to shoot the bell at one time. Mm, mm -hmm. But my tip to new players is always pick one, you point them out. It's kinda like when you're in an emergency and you need help, you like you don't just say yell someone call 911 you like point at someone and say you you call 911 because then mm -hmm. it clicks quicker because you're like oh you're talking to me so you pick somebody you're like you shoot the bell you two guard the doors or guard the hallway because if you have five people shooting you're all just gonna get wiped out by someone coming through um all right if you have one person shooting that one person's got a better chance of hitting more bell shots than seven people blindly firing into it mm -hmm. um that's my tip um, I'm, I like Hell's Bells as a game. It's not my favorite. Uh, it's really high. It's a very high teamwork game, I think, in order to actually win. Yeah. So unless you get people that pick up the session pretty quick, it ends up kind of being a stomp fest between the regulars as new people kind of wander trying to figure out what to do. And then they mm -hmm. just get picked off by the regulars all day. Which is okay, right. but it makes it less fun for new people who don't know what's going on. I feel uh -huh. like to get like a good win, like the win where you feel like really accomplished about it, like everybody has to be involved. Right. So, I mean, I I feel like one of the other things with like, depending on where you're playing Hell's Bells, and of course, like again, like I'm thinking very shanty specific because that's where I play the most. <laughs> but like, with Shanty, there's so many places that you can be when you're playing Hell's Bells that matter, like being upstairs, over the middle hallway, in those two spots across the hallway, 
um, like opposite sides upstairs because you can still see the bell and everybody who's going to the center of the map from those spots. And like they're just as important as being underneath the bell and shooting it because if you don't have good cover in that game, you can't get the job done. So like you, it's just really like it's not something that's easily accomplishable by yourself. So you really have to rely on other people to be watching your back and being conscious of like those angles. And if you don't, it's just, again, it's one of those games where you're running back and forth, running back and forth, running back and forth, sacrificing, like, all of this time just to constantly get back to the bell, hoping that you'll be able to ring it enough times for it to matter. <clears throat> Likes it. Um, you consider that some advanced strategy? I mean, I guess, sure. <laughs> I mean, when you're talking about, like, people who are paying attention to, like, angles and those kind of, like, nitpicky things that really matters in games like that, absolutely, just because you kind of have to have, uh, like, I don't want to say you have to kind of already be well acquainted with the map, but you at least have to have enough wherewithal to like make the conscious choice to be looking for those places because like somebody who's new isn't going to walk onto the map and know that from the room like right to the side of the middle hallway from rick and morty spot and you can see straight to the bell if you stand against the wall and like somebody who plays there all the time is and is going to take out the other people from the other spawn like almost immediately when they're running to the bell because you know where to stand so, like, if you don't have somebody on the other map also standing in that off-the-side room, you're not going to have anybody taking care of that person. So, it's, like, again, it's one of those games where it's, like, if you don't have people to rely on, it's just going to be a constant back-and-forth, back-and-forth, running, hoping you make a difference. Which isn't really fun for anybody. <laughs> Especially not the person who's doing all the running back-and-forth. Oh, yeah. I like that. Uh, Christian, how about your advanced strategy? Advanced strategy. For me, it's different. Um, what are you doing with the regulars? For, what am I doing with the regulars? Okay. So for Alcatraz, it would be... Since I know how... I've been Since I've been at this for like a bit, I kind of learned how people play. We have our downstairs players. So I would designate our one to two downstairs players to be in the shower, shooting the bell from under the vent, or trying their best to, to keep the other downstairs players in check. And then we got all the regular, like, you know, upstairs players. The, re the way I would like to do it on Alcatraz is that there's always that middle spot, back middle, that everyone loves very much because you're able to shoot both staircases in cover. Mm -hmm. I would have one person there at all times. One person is approaching... One person approaches the bell from the left side, from the main staircase, one, the moment you go up the main staircase. And then one person would go on the right side staircase, no matter what spawn you're in. There's always a right side staircase that's easier to access. Mm -hmm. One person's going to go up there. I'm, a, I'm doing this plan from... Uh, f f uh, one, two, three, four, five. Five regulars. Five regulars. So... Two, I would have two in that middle spot, one, one shooting at each staircase, and then two are rushing the sides, and then that fifth regular will be downstairs trying to hit the bell from the shower room. Hmm. That's how I would do it. So, so it's just basically perfectly placing the regulars to a point where they could optimize their kill potential while holding the other team down. And then we will hopefully clear the way to tell all the new people, like, hey, come up here, go into that room right there, and right. there's the bell. Go shoot it. Okay, so because... you're kind of, like, laying ground to, like, mm -hmm. have shots at the bell, but not a mm -hmm. be a main priority for regulars and, like, send new people upstairs. Mm-hmm. If I have to go shoot the bell, I'll go shoot the bell. Like, it's not that hard. <clears throat> all right. I like objective, so... <laughs> Me too. I feel that. Mm -hmm. Sorry. Um, I like to sweep the back if I'm playing with a bunch of regulars or people that know what they're doing. Um, a lot of the focus for Hell's Bells tends to be on what's directly in front of you. 
uh, as you're playing. Let me get this mic so the shadow's out of the way. Um, I was going to say, Chris, you're being blocked. <laughs> yeah, I saw that. Um, so pretty much the whole focus is just, it's always like just ramming into each other over and over and over and then just like getting a couple of bell hits at a time. Usually someone will hold it down for a little bit. Um, and then the, the outside flanks, I know you talked about this earlier, the outside flanks will usually get ignored. Um, and that's where you can get a lot of play, at least on the Chicago maps, where you can come around the side flanks either direction and then come right up the back stairs uh, to score tons of bell hits because you could wipe out the entire upstairs defense and get a good 30 seconds of uninterrupted shooting of the bell. Mm -hmm. The That's how the actual, the last tournament went uh, in the finals because we played Hell's Bells for the last game. Oh, yeah, that's true. And... Sure. It was our team and then the team from Madison uh, with uh, with Old Fat and Slow and and your brother and um, Burn. Uh, they had a wildly good, talented team. And it right. ended up, the first game, <clears throat> we scored a ton of points because we were playing like conventionally, so we had an advantage because we, we knew the map better. But mm -hmm. then the second round, like, everybody just started flanking each other. Like, Fern and your brother came, like, running up the back staircase, wiped us out a couple times, uh, and it was just wild. Oh, yeah, there you go. Reaper, Rex. Oh, that's right. Brian was on that team, too. Mm -hmm. Yep, Brian oh, was on that God, team. God, I forgot about him. And it was just, like, a flanking fest where, like, I would come up the back staircase, kill a couple people. Fern and uh, Steve would come up the back staircase. A squid would come up the back staircase. People are just flanking everywhere, and it was just wild. <laughs> it was mayhem. Um, I just realized I have stuff all over the screen. Um, you just, oh, you're still being blocked. <laughs> yeah. Um, cool. <laughs> but it was just it was just nuts. Like the amount of stuff you can do, right, is just insane when you don't have an overcrowded game where it's like twenty on twenty. Right, and I think like. I don't know. Hell's Bells can be really one of those, like, unfortunate games where, like, again, one person is doing, like, most of the work because they know they don't have enough people to, like, support them, realistically, if that makes sense. Because, like, the chances that you're going to be on a team with five, like, four other regulars, including yourself, is slim, at our field, at least. Like, you're getting split up. Because generally, like, at max, there's, what, like, six regulars? In, like, a session by happenstance? Right. Maybe. You know what I mean? And then, like, it's three on three, and, like, yes, they can do as much as they can from all the angles that they can do it at. But, like, I think at the end of the day, it's, like, one of those things where it's, like, House Bells really ends up being one of those games where it's, one, very intensely team-based, very intensely strategy-based, and, like, a lot of the time, you just don't have the team like to execute the strategy that you need to in like a public session right. <laughs> which is kind of i think like the downfall of a game like hell's bells because it is a really 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 fun intense um like well-rounded game if you do have the players for it and if you don't it kind of becomes one of those games where it's like i don't want to fucking do this i'm going for kills sure uh -huh. yeah. so uh, we have someone that took us up on our offer to come on and talk. Yay! We have Yay! our second guest host. Ooh. I'm going to unmute him right now. Hey, Mr. Fire Mandrill, how you doing? Hello! Oh, hey, there, man. Oh, unmute yourself. I think he is. Oh, no, he's muted. I see it. Oh, Hold God. on, I'll be right back while this is happening. All right, well, we, well, we figure this out. Mm -hmm. Um... Oh, okay, there it goes. So weird. Okay. Oh, and Bird, you gotta reset your uh, video. I think I'm fine. Okay, got it fixed. Oh, there you go. Welcome. Right. Sweet. Hey, man. Hello there. How's it going, guys? Good. Doing How are you? Good. Doing great. Pretty good. Pretty good. Awesome. Welcome. Welcome to the chat. There we go. I just fixed it so now we have a nice, clean. A uh, nice clean look on the screen. We're not in our boxes anymore, so love that. We're, we're Do I need to reset my video, or is that fine? Um, you're okay now. It's un unfrozen. Okay, wonderful. I, I was just moving a lot. Yeah, you're good. All right, so now we have some insight from Michigan. 
What Yay. Hell's Bells like on your field, sir? Hell's Bells is kind of interesting on our field. So it's mostly spent of, uh, if you have a decent amount of new players, we try and corral them towards the middle so they can get the points and they can get up there on the leaderboard uh, while we're trying to give them covering fire. And if that's not working, then some of our uh, more experienced players will rush in and start guitar soloing the middle uh, hell spell. <laughs> guitar soloing? Love that. <laughs> guitar soloing. <laughs> that's incredible. <laughs> I like that. That's where we uh, go on one knee and just bring the gun up so we're not even looking down the sight and uh, hammering on the trigger. Just... It looks yeah. exactly like a guitar solo. <laughs> that's wild. That's actually exactly what it looks like. That's mm -hmm. incredible! <laughs> Never oh called it a goodness. guitar solo before. I just call it fire and hope no one shoots you. <laughs> that's, that's wild. I love that. Period. That's really good. We might need to spread that across the fields. <laughs> Absolutely. Please do. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, this was random, but I don't know if anybody's watching the, sh the chat, but um, Old Hat and Slow, Steve, is also making a note about Waukesha where definitely shoot the bell from upstairs not on the on the you know underneath it like the other fields because you can do that there which is pretty sick ah that's a bit I remember wild. the one and only time I played well in Waukesha actually was because I was upstairs and I was the only person small enough to hide behind the only cover that was up there and also still shoot the bell. And Nick was like watching my back and shooting over me and behind me. <laughs> that was great. Very nice. Awesome. Love it. Love it. So what's it? What's uh? What's going on out in Michigan? How are you guys doing out there? We're doing pretty good. Um, like I was saying in the chat, we had uh, this last week we all got uh, two games in on I think it was Friday, mm -hmm. Friday or Sunday. Um, like right but... before your guys' stay at home order went into effect. Yeah, right <laughs> before. <laughs> yeah, we well, didn't. Nice. That. We've all just been staying in. Yeah, we didn't even get the option. They announced it on Thursday, and I combat closed for us right away. Yeah, so it was like, done, yeah, though. we're not gonna, we're not gonna stay open Friday. We're gonna shut it down, which is good. Yeah, I mean, honestly, yeah, it came, it came later than it should have, but <laughs> that's just the tea. Everyone's staying healthy. Everyone's doing well out there. Yeah, we're all doing pretty good. Uh, <laughs> we're trying to keep our gatherings under ten. <laughs> good. <laughs> that's that's a good thing. Yeah, you can play better. four on four. That's technically less than ten. <laughs> that is true. That is true. The two was, team leaders on the field, and uh, yeah. I was just All on right, a walk with my here. roommate earlier today, and I was like, I didn't think that I would feel this way, but I miss laser tag. <laughs> It's a, it's a know, thing. This right? is the this is the first week where we're actually just not going to be able to play for a long like. Yeah, I've been playing effectively every week for three years. <laughs> we're gonna start going to withdrawals. Like this... I just need to shoot someone. <laughs> oh, like Orlando! You see Orlando's Facebook post. He's yeah. literally at work with a pencil, <laughs> and he's trying to shoot. He's around the wall. <laughs> Catch me in the office with a staple gun. Oh no. Yeah! Oh, man. <laughs> oh god. That's so funny. Sometimes I take my PS4 controller and I do this. And then like... <laughs> Start pushing the buttons from the side. Yeah. That's what I do. Wow. So wait, Wisconsin's down to five people maximums. Ooh. Huh. Oh. He said, seriously, I don't know what to do with myself. Boy, I feel that. I went to, okay, so this is so off topic, but I feel like we're already heading in that direction. But I went to Trader Joe's, like, close to my house today, and I l had literally gone there, like, two days ago to pick something up. <laughs> Fuck off. No, no, there, no like, I'm looking at the ago. chat. I'm looking at the chat, and Liana's he like, said, I keep so telling bad. Reagan that we should go for a run just yelling pew pew at each other. <laughs> 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 this is why you don't read chat while you're streaming. 
make me feel go better. Go run yelling pew pew at each other. That's you might so as well funny. buy Nerf guns from Walmart and go to the park. Like, <laughs> so I went to my grocery store and I had been there like two days before and it was fine, whatever, right? They were letting people in like normal because not that many people were showing up. And me and Cam, my roommate, were on a walk today and we were like, oh, let's walk to Trader Joe's, whatever. Like, let's pick up a few things while we're out. And, um, we got there and there was a line and like the dude at the front door was like we're only letting in five people at a time and i'm like oh all right so we stood the line for like not that long it was a pretty quick line because people were like just like in and out in and out so it wasn't a big deal but it was like the first time i feel like i was actually like standing there and like oh wow this is like like for serious for serious like this is not okay <laughs> so yeah. i definitely had a little bit of a like i don't want to call it a reality check because i've been taking it very seriously ever since it like got serious here but it was one of those things where i was like okay this is very seriously affecting like my grocery store my everyday living like what i'm doing and it just kind of was one of those things where like i felt weird i was like i don't know what i'm doing <laughs> yeah 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 it's like the uh the, the weekend we were out getting groceries as everything was being announced yeah we were at target and we're, we're doing the self-checkout and this lady had a problem like something wasn't scanning that i honestly like think i've thought about that way too many times since it happened it makes me uncomfortable the, to think about the, the way that the woman was acting was just wild so it was like sporadic and we were like i don't know like what her problem is and then we noticed that like her nose was red like she had been blowing it and she was yeah. uh, Nope, 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 nope. Yeah, she like the uh nope. the, the right, the worker came over to help her and she like basically dead ass sprinted away from her. Like they came yeah. over like, "Oh, I'll clear that for you." And she was just like, "No! Get away from me." Yeah. She, that that's not even like an accurate. She literally walked to the other side of like the self-checkout counter and like the worker was like, "What's like, are you okay?" And she was like, "I She was like not talking cuz she didn't have a mask." Right. So she was just like, I, I can't get close to you. Like, I don't want to like, I don't want to get you sick or something like that. And it was just like, it was too much. It was very anxiety ridden moment. <laughs> yeah, it was, it was Dude, wild. Yeah. Like I looked Owl, at Matt and I was just like. Spot. The ick. <laughs> yeah, I didn't feel good about any of that interaction. I was like. <laughs> oh, and that was the first time the entire weekend that we had like. An, an interaction like moment. that. Yeah, everybody else yeah. was like really chill and just kind of buying their stuff and moving on. But. Which, speaking of that night, we saw Speedrunner and Joe Rebel that night at the grocery store. We did. We were at Mariano's and we saw Joe and Joey. (laughs) I rammed them with my cart. (laughs) Did you? Yeah, I did. A wild, regular appearance. Oh, yes. Oh, so I know. Anyways. Yeah, so (laughs) Illinois, I think, is still on track for April 7th. Is when the first order is supposed to run out. Uh, oh, the uh, Wisconsin just got pushed all the way back to April twenty fourth. <laughs> so their order is, is in effect Wisconsin for a getting full worse? month. Yeah, they, well, they're just extending it. Um, oh, okay. they didn't have a full stay in place order until this weekend. Oh, um, so theirs okay. just well, got announced. Sense. But like ours was for two and a half weeks. Theirs is for a full month. Mm-hmm. Wow. And then uh, I think Michigan. You guys are about a month out too, right? We're April 14th thus far. Okay, so you got about two and a half weeks still, too. Right. I don't even wow, think those crazy. dates are real, though. I think it's going to go a little bit further than that. I mean, the way yeah, people are like, talking, they're, like, projecting yeah. into, like, the early summer. Not even, like, late summer. Which is, like, not necessarily for quarantine, but for, like, taking precautions and, like, keeping the amount of people that you see down and, like, the places that you go. So, I don't know. Hey. Yeah, I know up here uh, it's not acting too serious right now, so we probably will get off of it around April 14th. Oh, yeah. Uh, mm-hmm. You guys have a lot more rural of area. Grocery store. That's true. Yeah, yeah. We... Well, hopefully it works out well. It's nice, though. Less human contact. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Love yeah, Jesus it's nice to be fire. able to barely see your neighbor. Oh, uh-huh. what did I do? Did I just break my system? You went dark. (laughs) Something just happened. We all went dark. Hey, Thermit. (laughs) Look at that. (laughs) Thermit. Mm. (laughs) My wonderful icon. Oh, I know what happened. Hold on, I'll fix this. 
Oh God, yeah, we did. I didn't even see that till just Hold now. On. I'm gonna restart the call really quick. Oh, okay. I know what happened. We're back. The call. Uh, okay, cool. Um, Great. I've been I, I, hey! I I've been monitoring the uh, people that want to talk in a web browser, <laughs> and when I joined a channel on there, it kicked everybody out of here because it took control of my, my cameras. Oh, uh, okay, that makes sense. Because apparently, uh, um, I'm not a computer genius. <laughs> you try really hard. Oh, look at that! We got hey! video now. Hey! Oh my god! I realized that that was off on my end. Look at this <laughs> dapper gentleman. Hey, bro. <laughs> Dude, we're hey, gonna start charging people to watch this. Look at this handsome man on the fucking screen. Oh, Finally making it apparent. Mitt. <laughs> it's so <laughs> weird to talk to people like this. Wow. Social interaction over yeah. the internet is great. <laughs> Oops, I didn't. Yeah, it really is, especially right now. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Needed more now than ever. True stories. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so should we hop back onto Hell's Bells, or are we just gonna, like, let the Rona take the conversation to wherever it goes at this point? I mean, point? at this point, yeah. I think we've, we've pretty much covered as, about as much as Hell's Bells as we can, unless we get some Waukeshonians or Madisonites in here. That's true, yeah, because, I mean, we, uh, clearly Chicago is spoken for, Michigan is now spoken for, officially. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> Good night, Steve. Have a nice night. Thanks for coming out, buddy. All right. Night, Steve. <laughs> Good night, Steve. Night, Steve. Sleep Steve. well. By the way, yeah. Steve is dodging bullets. I was talking to him earlier. He said all the Oof. dealerships around him where he works are starting to close up. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, and he works he as a mechanic, work... so he's... Does he work for a mechanic at, like, a big dealership? Or does is it, like... I think he does. Oh, a different, like, video. an independent shop. Oh, no, he's gone. Um, I don't know oh, exactly. It's... Hmm. Weird. Okay, yeah. I thought it was like an independent mechanics, which would oh, I suppose make sense. Oh, dealer. Oh well, nope, it sure isn't. Cool. Look at this guy saying he's about to leave and then comes right back. <laughs> you can't get you know, away Steve, from us. He can't kick it. We're like a bad habit. I have to pee again because I drink too much water. I'll Go be right. Mm -hmm. Go to the bathroom. We got plenty of hosts. Wonderful. Yeah, look at all of us here. Uh oh, so, so, uh, so what do you do when you're not doing eye combat? Wait, Let's talk about that. Fireman, fireman drill, it's my internet. Oh, well. <laughs> well, oh, did we lose him? that's how that is. Uh, I th uh, oh, apparent? Oh, oh, he's... oh, I think so. Okay. Oh, God, Whoa, he, he's gone on here. Oh, man. The, oh, oh. owl, the second eye combat opens up, scouts are having an all day session. Says by a Levi. Okay. Um. Oh. All right. Back again. Um. The, oh. 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 He's coming. He's on his way. But what do we do outside yeah. what do you of do outside combat? of eye combat? Like, since we can't oh. shoot people oh. in the next since foreseeable future. I know you and I. We're gamers. We've been playing lots of Warzone. Oh, exactly. But uh. When, uh, let's say, uh, not just outside of eye combat, when it's not a pandemic out there. Uh, so, like, when it's not a pandemic out there, I am in my last semester of school. I'm going to graduate this semester. And then I have, uh, other than eye combat, I also work at the high school that I graduated from. I am a, I'm one of the tennis coaches there. So, from... From Monday through Friday, from 3.30 to 5 o'clock, I am coaching these children. Okay. That's what I'm doing. <laughs> there we and go. then... Oh, hey, hey there we <laughs> <laughs> Internet's okay? Everything fine? <laughs> yeah, just Boonie's internet. Boonie's internet. <laughs> Boonie's internet. <laughs> nice. It must stink when it comes to video games. Oh, it doesn't Actually, it's pretty nice. Games. I've got my Xbox okay. hardlined. The, oh, okay, okay, okay. That's what matters. It's all about the Ethernet cable or the LAN cable. It's the best way to do it. I learned that on my own without anyone telling me. Uh, <laughs> I was like, hey, this cable port goes into the computer. I bet it goes into the router. And then I tried it. I was like, that download was only 10 seconds. And then I was like, that's it. 
Line cable, all the way. <laughs> yeah, that's the way to do it. Absolutely. Okay. Hey, we got more people. Hey! Oh, we got more people. <laughs> oh, man. We're, we're bringing everybody in. <laughs> oh, let's bring... We got Liana joining us. Hello. On hey. Hi, uh, Liana. <laughs> oh, God. I, I have like, to fix everything hey, again. Oh, what have I done? And Oh god, what did I do? Is there, is everything okay? Oh, oh gosh. It's fine, I'll fix it. My empty okay, seat is the highlight it. of the podcast. Yeah, Liana! Yeah, just... ah! Hey girl! <laughs> going on? Not much. I saw your hilarious TikTok with your fur coat. So cute, Beach. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> it's so cute. I don't know anything that you just said. <laughs> Maybe. Oh, I got you. Okay. It, it took a second, but it clicked. Uh, stuff we do outside of iCombat. Who, who wants to play D and D? Let's go. Really? Ooh. Ooh, I like roll 20. It'll be fun. Are you using like a voice chat like this or thick? Thick, thick, thick. Anybody else who's watching and they want to. Oh. Okay. Hmm. Well, we know Birdie visits parks illegally, so... Oh no. Oh no. I've done a terrible thing. I changed I changed the scene and everyone was muted. Oh no. Oh. Oh. Oops. Oh, no. That's all right. We all right, we only know bad. about what we've been talking about. <laughs> all right, here's the synopsis. I mean, We're all nerds. People play D. &D. <laughs> she does 2 D and D. She's not prepped for tomorrow. She goes to parks that she shouldn't go to. <laughs> How oh, dare you? <laughs> <laughs> I'm very sorry about that, guys. I, I had to make a brand new <laughs> video scene for this because it's just too much stuff for one screen. Um, and the way my audio is, etc. it just, I fucked it up. So I apologize. That's all right. We, it's a learning curve. We are all learning together. We got to have more people on this because, like, if we don't, there's no social interaction. <laughs> Correct. Also, if anybody yeah. else wants to join us, go ahead and jump into the gear swap or the brought streaming live, and I'll pull you into this. Might chat. as well. <laughs> Get everybody Fuck in up here. This stream even more, baby. <laughs> <laughs> to, to quote some famous broadcasters from the, the early 2000s, fuck it, we're going to do it live. There you go. <laughs> I, I like that quote. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you said we can't hang out in groups? Well, hold on. Let's just... <laughs> I mean, right now we're legal in Wisconsin, so... Hey, One more and we're going to have to take this outside of Wisconsin. <laughs> 
<laughs> no Wisconsin people are in this chat. That's what's funny. You know what honestly has been like the downfall of my quarantine thus far is not having a gym to go to. I got to be real honest. I have not been working I, out the way that I should be. And it is a problem, ladies and gentlemen. I'm about to come out of quarantine weighing like what I started when I started my fitness journey, which is a problem. Didn't you just <laughs> message me the other day saying that you were the lowest you've been in a while? That was like a couple days ago. Things change, all right? I've had a lot of brownies. I've <laughs> eaten a lot of stir fry. I had orange chicken and white rice the other night. It holds water. I've, I've made mistakes, okay? <laughs> quarantine snacks are real. It really... I've been working from home. That's it's valid. awful. I've just been like, like this morning I woke up, so me and my roommate, we made brownies the other night. Mm -hmm. And I woke up this morning, I walked into the kitchen, they were just sitting on the stove, tempting me. So I walked up and I was like, I just have a little snack before breakfast. Lord knows I did not eat breakfast until 12 p.m. And I had only had brownies the entire morning. Hey, it's Ben! Well, we found what Ben up, in bed. Oh, oh, Ben, oh! <laughs> Man, he's chilling like a villain. Please oh, tell me you got Big Macs to serve us. <laughs> yeah, please. <laughs> so funny. But yeah, that's okay. my, my biggest struggle. All I'd be doing is eating and then laying up in my bed. It is a issue. <laughs> what are you up to, Ben? I was... Oh, Ben, man. Oh, he took How's his headphones been? off. Oh. Hey, guys. Oh, there we are. Hey. <laughs> yeah, don't yeah, don't listen to the uh don't listen to the stream if you're on the if you're on the channel, you'll be delay brain fucked. <laughs> oh. There you go. That, that had to get muted. Uh, should we should we ask anybody if they have like well I don't I don't even know who's in the chat that isn't here. I guess powers, powers. owl. Yeah. All the kiddos are probably playing uh, scribble right now. Ah, that's right, Scribble. Oh, I got a round of Scribble going. Okay, hey, okay. Scribble's going on? Oh, shoot, what am I doing here? <laughs> oh, the party's up in Scribble. <laughs> Why am I hanging out on every the Scribble game we have, dude, his attendance is 100% right now. <laughs> <laughs> if Scribble was a class in school, he would have an A. Yo, honestly... I mean, my account names have made it so that people don't realize who I am till like midway through. That's fair. <laughs> Are you the person yeah, who shut up as Nicole, or was that somebody else? <laughs> no, not me. No, that's no, me. no, no, no. I I really thought Nicole was playing. I was like, damn, how'd y'all got get Nicole on here? Like, what? <laughs> <laughs> we are sociable nerds. We can talk to females. <laughs> I Make never it. accused you of such things, but I just thought it Sorry, was peculiar. Sorry, I felt peculiar. a little attacked. I felt a little attacked. It's okay. I just thought did it you... was peculiar. I really did. Because, you know, I just really didn't think that Nicole would choose to socialize and scribble outside yeah, no. of, of my combat. <laughs> I doubt it. <laughs> there are worse ways. It's true. It's true. <laughs> Shouldn't have jumped the gun so quick, but I was still correct. <laughs> <laughs> it indeed was not her. <laughs> oh, all right, damn. I got all my shilling back up on the stream. So we got the chat, we got the emotes, we got the alerts. Woo, everything's back. I broke it. I fixed it, I mean. Congratulations. I, I fixed it. Thank you. Mm -hmm. We should go <laughs> hang out in the park and celebrate. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I can hang from the monkey bars again? I'm down. I ain't done that since I was in fifth grade. I mean, Spring exercise though, right? <laughs> Exactly. That's what I was saying. I ran I around the park the a little bit. I did a couple of sit-ups while I was hanging from the monkey bars. I really got creative. I did some jump squats on like the little, you know, thing that separates like the wood chips from the grass. It was great. It was great. Hey, thank you for the cheers, Powers. Oh, <laughs> uh, thanks, yeah. Powers. He's just pitching in his <laughs> legitimate <laughs> two cents. Thank you, Patrick. I feel like we need to go from saying hype in the chat to guns in the chat, even though that's a guns little violent, but like, I feel like it's appropriate. That could potentially get us demonetized. I'm in. <laughs> or, or we could get sponsored by <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Which I don't, I don't approve of, but also like, I'm not mad. <laughs> I mean, we can always just drop the icks in the chat now. There you go. Ick in the chat. <laughs> icks in the chat. <laughs> Oh god. By the way, isn't that ick cute? Is it though? It's really cute. Yeah. I do that. I'm an artist. 
That's, <laughs> that's pretty nice. I like it, yeah. He's oh, like, man, no big spreading. deal, but like, I did that. <laughs> I know how to use Photoshop. <laughs> I don't condone looking at the ick as cute, but also, it's pretty alright looking. Oh, we got so much ick in the chat. I love it. <laughs> Concerning amounts of ick. <laughs> oh, I just realized I never gave the, uh, the episode title for this episode. So this is episode 7, otherwise known as 2020 needs to be rebooted. Oh God, yeah, she got a virus bad. We need and a don't hard be looking to reinstall. Like, mm -hmm. don't even go from backup; just start fresh. Honey <laughs> caught some shit from LimeWire. Like <laughs> Every morning I wake up, I go damage report. <laughs> LimeWire—that's a term I haven't heard in a hot minute. <laughs> she said, "I'm sick." <laughs> oh. It's not anybody even... who's seen Mean Girls understands that. Yes. <laughs> it's it's not even like it was a it's not even like one of those viruses that just punches you in the face. It's one of them that's like sits on your computer for seven weeks. And it's like yeah. like what you doing over there? How's it going? <laughs> and then you go to click on something and they move the window, you're like, Oh, that's weird. Why did that happen? And then your font <laughs> exactly. starts coming up backwards, you're like, something isn't right here. And then you hit restart and you're like why is my hard drive not here anymore? I don't know what's going on. <laughs> oh, oh, man. No. One of those. Oh, oh Super no. Meat Boy. Oh, that's what I need to do. I should play Super Meat Boy. Uh -huh. oh, 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 I just saw the emo. Okay. Are you not? Are you are you familiar with Super Meat Boy? Mm -hmm. Um, I, I personally know. Mm -hmm. So it is. I it's am a, not. <laughs> it's like Mario Brothers on crack. So oh. it mm -hmm. is, it's a, it's just a platformer oh game. Gosh. Yeah. Where you can do like wall jumps and you have to avoid stuff. There's no really like jumping on enemies to get through levels, but it's all just navigating these like incredibly difficult levels with extreme precision. And if you okay. die, your guy explodes. It's great. Oh, oh, yeah. You're you like, like a little ball of meat. Like a meat, like, bleh, like, yeah, you're like a, meat? you're like a ball of ground beef basically. Oh, <laughs> you know what? Mm. <laughs> Sounds kind of fun, actually. Yeah, it's really fun. <laughs> it, it sounds a little nasty, but like, okay. <laughs> For anyone that likes Baja Blast, they're selling these in stores now. So. They can't drink pop anymore. Are they? Are they? Are they selling them in stores? Oh, I was supposed to give you a new thing, and I didn't do it. I'm slacking on my job. Well, you got one more week without another thing, I guess. But are they selling them in stores everywhere? Uh, like, is it I just like a, a thing now again? Or I went to I me and Ben went to Woodman's for these. So. Oh, yeah, okay. I mean, they've got them in my local grocery store, and it's one off. So oh, wow. okay. Wow. Nice. Usually, I've never been a big be... Baja Blast drinker, oh, but yeah. I understand that people are like liquid cocaine. Yeah, yeah. it's it so usually solved by something though. so much worse. AKA exactly, Liana, liquid cocaine. <laughs> liquid cocaine. So this is with me tomorrow. We're going to good uh, Woodman's, right? Oh yeah, we're all getting in Roberto's car again, right? All five of us. Yeah. What's okay. Woodman's. Cool. Roberto. It's the, it's a, the Commander Irwin. Yeah, his name is okay. Roberto. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, uh, oh, <laughs> real names? Who? <laughs> I always feel yeah. weird learning people's real names. Um, I know. On the I'm, just I'm like, at that point where I'm using everyone's real name now instead of their gamer tag. So. I mean, that's fair. We are we Hello, are forced to live in real life, so. It's always wild when I run into somebody from my combat in like the wild, and they're like, "Yo, Brock, <laughs> what's up?" Wild. I'm like, as if as if the grocery store or like any other place other than I combat is the wild, and I combat just where you live. Well, it's, that is real life. It's the closest you'll ever come to like a real life trainer battle because you'll just be walking around and you'll hear your game tag and you're just like, huh? <laughs> Who? And then you just well, hear the music in the background. It's just like <laughs> all of a sudden you're like up face to face with like Team Rocket. <laughs> 
don't or know. It's... I kind of just like having like conversations with like somebody's gamer tag, and you just sound like, "Oh yeah, Squirrel did this," and everyone's like, "Who talking about? What the fuck are you?" Saying? And Absolutely. you're like, "No, <laughs> Squirrel, man, what are you saying?" Yeah, yeah right. Uh, like a, you don't you know, know who Squirrel is. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what was that? Remember... We stepped. We stepped on you. What'd you say? Oh, oh. go ahead, Ben. Whoa. His oh, audio ben. broke up for me. Uh, were we still talking about the game attack thing? Yeah, yeah, go, go, go. Yeah. yeah, yeah, you're good. Okay, I was just making a. Okay, I was just making a joke about how I guess you'll never guess my real name uh, based on my game attack. Oh, oh, sure. <laughs> oh, oh, totally. I mean, ben? It's, it's, it's obviously Big Mac. <laughs> right. really it's obviously Mac. <laughs> <laughs> that's a name that's a real name uh, definitely could you imagine <laughs> somebody's valid. gamer tag is ben big mac and their name is mac not ben <laughs> that's that that's it. a mind fuck <laughs> or or if you're playing and reyna's doing ice it's ben big black oh no <laughs> oh my gosh that happened yeah. Vito in the chat. <laughs> somebody send some ick <laughs> <laughs> so pew pew uh, pew pew defend Oh yeah, pew, 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 defend. no, defender. Defender. <laughs> pew, pew, defender. Yeah. yeah, she called my brother defender. That was great. Oh, nice. So good. Um, <laughs> on on an upside, I did hear in Illinois they're going to open up the golf courses in about two weeks. Oh, thank God! <laughs> of course. Yeah, yeah right. Wrong, wrong, wrong stuff. Yeah, your boy's going golfing. <laughs> <laughs> you like to golf? Anyway. I love golfing. Yes. Ah! No one ever wants to go with me. Deal. I don't have my own set of clubs though. Birdie is surprisingly good, so she can come with. I'm I have okay. a good long game, but my short game sucks. That's really. I'm. But you the know opposite. what? I haven't played in a few years, so maybe that's a lie. Okay. No one goes with me. But that's this. because women be having that swing, bro. Like just we like, just got that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We we have the fire and anger and tenacity to support a good long game. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, but no patience for that short stuff. I'm like, damn. Yeah, it. that's some bullshit right there. <laughs> that that like one inch away from the fucking hole, and you're just looking at it like there's no way I'm gonna fucking get that shit in that hole. That it's yeah. not gonna happen. You turn that into Happy is... Gilmore. You know, <laughs> phrasing. There you go. <laughs> lordy, lordy. Oh, man. Oh. I want iCombat to come back. I miss it. Yeah, Please. me too, man. Oh. Holy, what the heck? <laughs> yeah, yeah, I need to run around. Better. I'm enjoying my days off. Oh, well. <laughs> Christian, the <laughs> only employee. On I have to stare at you for a second. Well, I'm an essential, so you know. <laughs> oh my gosh! Wait, what do you do? That's in essential. Fire and sales. Sales. Oh, okay. Oh, I guess yeah. that would make sense. Yeah. That, yeah <laughs> I don't okay. know. That's pretty <laughs> essential. <laughs> yeah, maybe just a little bit. I mean, that's I was more going essential. to make the joke saying that. I, let me guess, you work at GameStop. And, uh, <laughs> no, no, that sir has a real like... profession, as it were. <laughs> right. Oh god. Slightly more, more uh, Yeah, a little bit more essential than my moving services. <laughs> well, hey, people still gotta move. Like that is true. That is true. That Speaking is true. of people who still gotta move. <laughs> hey, hey, prices are going down because no one's moving. I know it's fucking lit. <laughs> I found two bedrooms for good prices. <laughs> I'm excited for us. We may have We're to torch the place to first to make sure that it's safe to in live the next in. Couple of months. Sweet. Oh, Gas in Woodlands is only a dollar eighty yes. per gallon. Ooh. Oh hell yeah! Let's go buy Wait, a fucking barrel. I was about to say, let's can go buy Woodlands. Is that something that we can keep indoors, or do we have to keep no. that outside? Absolutely uh... not. <laughs> Iffy? Iffy. Iffy. <laughs> <laughs> Depends on if you own the hole. Oh, that's fair. <laughs> is yeah. someone going to tell on you is what you're really saying? <laughs> yep, that's exactly what I'm saying. <laughs> he said, okay. don't tell. <laughs> but yes. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't oh, yeah, happen here. What are you find <laughs> Iffy? Like, <laughs> I hear it. Someone walks by, excuse me, sir, what's in that 50-gallon drum over there in the corner? <laughs> Like oh, oh it's paint. Yeah, that's my that's my that's short my name. 
<laughs> did you say short Nick? I did. Are you a baker? You'd be like, I'm a professional cook. Like, I, no, I no. always need a 50 gallon drum. Of doesn't shortening. doesn't everybody keep their old bacon grease? I mean, I thought it's that was my just me. Well, yeah. it's my water from the fountain of youth. Why do you think I always look 18, dude? Like, come on. Period. I'd explain <laughs> some stuff. There you like, go. Period. Just, be like, okay. this ain't plastic surgery, honey. This this is straight up magic. <laughs> Speaking of no plastic surgery, how about all these celebrities that can't get anything done for like the next month and a half? Look, we about to see who, how fucking old everybody is real soon. Dude, apparently Chris Hart's already got like, wait, Chris Hart? Is that the right Kevin? name? Kevin Hart, yes. I was thinking Chris Rock and Kevin Hart, whatever. Stop mixing up your black people, it's unacceptable. You said it, not me, okay? I apologize. We can't get married when you're doing shit like that, and that's period. <laughs> um... Apparently, his roots are growing out like crazy already, and it looks bad. Oh, no. Like, gray? Yes. He, apparently, he's completely gray. He dyes he it all the time. should just rock that. He he's, would look so good completely gray. He's like Why is he five foot one. He can't be short and gray. Hey, that's all. Oh, hey, hey. Man. That man's would be a silver fox, as far as I'm concerned. Kevin Hart is attractive. A fox? Period. He's just got to go from Chris Rock to Morgan Freeman real fast. (laughs) Branding. It's all about branding. (laughs) Oh, God. Oh, no. That's bad. (laughs) Um, I saw a picture of the what the Kardashians would look like, potentially, without all their Botox and that. Oh, no. Nobody needs to see that. It was rough. Nobody needs that. It was rough. Nobody. Here's the the shitty part too. Is like once you get all that shit done, like I'm like no, I'm not against it. I'm not necessarily for it. I'm not like don't do it. It's bad for you. Like do whatever you want. But like the thing is, is like once you do something like that, you can't come back from it. You know what I mean? Like that is something where it's like you have taken in your own hands like the natural aging and process of your body and like there isn't a way to like come back from that in a way that is like graceful or like naturally good looking. Like you just look bad when you age out of plastic surgery. It ain't cute. Like tons of celebrities who have been getting plastic surgery done for years are trying to do it right now and I'm like honey no 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 it's over for you <laughs> it's <just> bad <laughs> it's a bad choice it's a bad look like you might as well just quit because yeah. it ain't it <laughs> like you tried though you really tried <laughs> they really had us in the first half if you will exactly that's that's the one <laughs> all right the more memes we quote the better this will get all right we'll get that's this true. together <laughs> Do you even know who you're talking to right now? I was born for this. You guys guys merely adopted the meme-ness. I was born in it. Oh, well. Okay. okay. Another meme. He said, okay. okay." Oh, God. Ah, my soul needed this. (laughs) This one, you think you're going to take a nap. I'm just going to lay a meme right here. That was good. That was stealthy, under-the-radar vine meme. I see you. Just you just gonna lay a to meme go. right here. Smooth like butter. Oh, jeez. <laughs> the chat. Right here. Oh, oh, the oh, owl. Oh, okay, oh. boomer. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no, no. That's racist. Do we? <laughs> oh, we've been neglecting the chat. Oh, what did I just say? That felt weird. We've been Negle- neglecting. <laughs> yeah, I totally choked over that word. Oh, let's see if we get anybody else who wants to come in here. Bam that chat. By the way, this uh this little stream deck thing is fantastic. I finally actually configured it to actually work. Yay! So now I'm just like smashing button and uh Things are happening. And things are happening. So <laughs> it's so much easier than trying to do stuff on the fly. Congratulations, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Smash buttons and maybe things will happen. Right? Me playing <laughs> Smash Brothers. <laughs> Butt mashing is a proven effective method. Absolutely, sir. That's period. 80% of the time, it works every time. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> okay, we're up to four. 
<laughs> hey, we're up to <laughs> four. Are you telling me that telling Ben's me that background ben's picture is background... is a picture of him playing at combat? That's great. That's that's pretty good. That's pretty good. That is adorable. <laughs> We have a solid have a echo. Solid echo. Oh, yeah, we oh, do. Oh, yeah, I'm yeah. uncomfortable with hearing Hold that on, voice. I think I know what it is. All right. Yep, I figured it out. Oh, yeah, you definitely did. Yeah, Ben's wow, microphone was... Oh, he's magic! Maybe Ben's mic was believe. looping back at us. <laughs> oh, God. <sighs> I'm gonna have to pee again soon. This has been good. You gonna take another shot, too? Hey! Hey! <laughs> that was that not the screen's business, oh, but maybe now oh, I will. Two maybe shots I of vodka. Will. Ooh, two shots of vodka. <laughs> uh, two shots of tequila. Ain't nobody drinking vodka in this Caucasian household. Uh, I mean, that's fair. <laughs> is that Fresca? Yeah. Bro, Fresca is my jam. I've this never is the only carbonated shit I drink. What? Dude, Fresca, I used to drink Fresca with my dad, like, on the regular. Oh. My dad fucking loves Fresca. That shit is so good. This is the only pop we have in the house, and we have, like, four cases at all times. It's good, though. Like, Fresca's delicious. Yeah. It's the only soda with artificial sweetener that I'll drink. Like, yeah, truly. Yeah, it's the only thing carbonated, because I never drink pop anymore, so it's just this. Same. I feel that. It's the only carbonated drink I choose to have. Asking is champagne. you shall receive power. <laughs> Power's commanding things from the chat. Thinks this guy's drunk. What do we with need power. to do? What is he saying? He said to move the uh, emote thing because it was blocking the chat. Oh well, I, uh, I think that's a pretty fair request. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I will be it's commanded by no viewership. man. <laughs> commanded by no man. <laughs> you will do as the chat says. I am no man. Oh, looks Ben's like he's back. back. All right, I unmuted you. You're back. Thanks. Yeah, sorry. I had to connect my headphones. That was the audio loop. Oh, there I'm you go. Yep, yeah, much better. Go. I'm trying to get Dan to come say hi. Oh, hey. do it! Come on, Dan. Hey! Come on. I'll say a premature yeah, hello. I'm trying to turn my headphones yeah, on. on mobile hey, man! A wild oh, X-ray gun shows up. <laughs> Oh, oh. Let me get into a more boy. Uh, appropriate <laughs> camera angle. Yeah, get yourself into a nice power Hello. stance. This is so nice. I missed you guys. Wow. Yeah. Oh, we have to have more community streaming like this where we have people come on. It's so nice. Just so nice to see everybody's face, especially when we just can't do the regular laser tag shit. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. When I can't shoot you guys, you know, it's so nice to just see you in person. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Nice to just hang. Getting the, yeah. Getting the itch. Getting the itch. Yeah. Yeah. No. Like I said earlier, I'm not kidding. I'm gonna go for a run. And just yell pew pew. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I can't just sit still all day. Take a lesson from the owl. <laughs> just fucking <laughs> pew 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 from across the street. <laughs> Bro, I swear I hit you. Why didn't you die? <laughs> right. So you know what I was just. <laughs> you know what I was just thinking, bird. Remember yeah. when we went to the laser tag place that Brian West works at now? Yeah. And they have the 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 gun system that hooks up to your cell phone. Do you see the little icon? Oh, you mean that you can play outside six feet away from anybody you're with? Yeah. <laughs> I'm liking this. Perfect idea. timing. That sounds like it's a great thing to have right about now. <laughs> Pretty much, we can all just gang up in a forest preserve and just call it a day. Nobody needs to stand <laughs> yeah, next to each so other. So they have they have this. It's called Battle Company. This is a laser tag podcast. It's not just for iCombat. Um, it's actually not by iCombat at all. Anyways, whatever. Um, the so the system, it's like this big ass like plastic gun, like mm -hmm. uh, like almost like a gear gear of war style huge rifle. And it's pretty cool though. It syncs up with your mobile phone, and it uses the GPS on it to create like a digital barrier. So it's like a battle royal style system. And then on the oh, actual nice. face of the phone, it'll be like next to your gun. My lighting is. Ah, I'm gonna blind myself. <laughs> um, but like on the display, it'll show like your relative position with everybody else in the game. Mm -hmm. And then like you can walk over certain areas and pick up like supply drops and get up. It's really cool. Like shit. when you pick them up, it makes the like unpacking sound and shit like through the gun. Oh. Yeah. So like, yeah, it's pretty cool. It's like pretty legit. And then like once you get whatever weapon you get, I think that like at the time that we had played, 
it wasn't it was past beta but it was still in like Early. kind of like the newer like phases where like they were still figuring out like how often you would get certain like weapons and like certain classes of weapons so like class one class two class three class four whatever stuff like that so like how powerful it is and all that stuff so like you would definitely get like the lower class weapons the most unless you were like the last like three or four mm -hmm. so it was definitely like a little bit harder to get higher class weapons but again they said that they were working on those type of things already but like was it, it was really really legit and real cool yeah and also i wouldn't like the guns were a little like like kind of like nerf-esque yeah They're if that makes sense -ish. like yeah, they're very, like, definitely, like, less, you know, like, high combat -ish guns where you have, like, the metal, like, heavy, whatever, like, very, like, real, like, tactical laser tag feel and more, like, classic nerf, whatever. But, like, the technology that came along with, like, working it with your phone was so interactive and really fucking cool. And if you have the gun, you can do it anywhere with any friend you just have like with anybody you're playing with you just have to set up the perimeters for it which is so fucking cool mm -hmm. yeah, it just, just makes it like really accessible yeah it's like it doesn't require a computer system so it's like all decentralized and run by the gps so like you would spread out in a big area everyone hits the ready to play it just checks your coordinates and makes a map and you go it's wild That's it. it's what we need now <laughs> truly i'm gonna call a b west and order like 10 guns no, nine guns. Can't have ten people. Right. <laughs> That's true. That's, That's right. too many. We'll get fined so per wait. Chicago's ordinance. True story. Really? <laughs> what was the social huh. called? Uh, really? The name They're of that is... Finding people? They're going to start, yeah. The police were locking down the lakefront today. Yeah, because too many people I were out it. there. Yeah. The I do, too. Oh, is it the like, when Chris Kerr announced that they were doing house... People were, like doing like crazy house parties. Yeah, the name of the the name of that laser tag system was Battle Company. In case anyone mm -hmm. wants to look it up. They're based right out of um Milwaukee. Um they run events on the weekends I think still, but not now obviously. Yeah. Um maybe we'll go up there again cuz they actually had an indoor setup like uh like I combat as well where it's just a regular field. Rates are a little bit more arcadey. I think it was like twenty, ten or twenty dollars for like a fifteen minute session. You get like three or four games. Oh, um, but we got to play it. It was fun. It was. They don't have vests. That's the big thing. So you get your <laughs> gun and you get a headband, and that's it. <laughs> so it's the only thing you can shoot the gun and the headband. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Yeah, it's yeah, fun. Quite a pricey system. Oh, what are the what are their prices on there? I know it was a couple hundred bucks per gun, I think. Uh, yeah, like maybe three hundred for the BRX rifle, which is the standard. Looks like. Yeah, that's the and big one. For some of them. Okay. Oh wow! Oh god, the suspense is killing me. <laughs> Well, my Wi-Fi. Oh, uh, your internet's shitting out on you, Ben. Yeah, it's breaking up. Dead, so taking ten minutes per page. Oh, there we go. This is faster than. What happens when you're trying to load six <laughs> video streams at a time? Oh yeah. All right. Um. Well, what are we at? We're at eleven o'clock. You guys. Just. No, oh, Ben's a robot. I can't hear you, Ben. I'm sorry. Thermit's back. Whoa, Thermit's now somewhere in hell, it looks like. Oh. Outside. Outside. Oh, what? Nice. Yes, in the middle of nowhere. What are you doing outside? My internet just took a crap inside my house. What is going on? Um, That's a creepy in the spot for your camera to freeze, by the way. <laughs> oh, it's back. <laughs> you were like frozen like in this, this is position. A horror movie now. Could be. I mean, it's getting close to the shining out here, so. Oh, that's right. It's, it's, yeah, it's midnight shining. over there for you guys. Uh, what are we at? We're at eleven o'clock. 
Yeah, I think we're gonna start wrapping this up here in a couple couple minutes. People's internet seems to be crapping out, and it's about that time. I gotta do an upload, and I got work in the morning. Um, you guys are welcome to stick around for the uh for the exit here, the outro, if you will. Um, I'll probably drop off. I don't well, think uh, you guys can hear me. Yeah, no, you're you're breaking in and out, Ben. All right, take it there. All right, later, Ben. Bye, Ben. All right, so let's later, do this. Buddy. Since we got since we got some people in here that uh, that aren't normally here, I have to get ready to do the outro, so I'll go last. But um, let's go let's go with uh with our last person to join, Liana. What are you guys up to? What do you got going on? Anything you want to promote? You can put out any shout outs, any plugs. The floor is yours for a good minute and a half. Um, well, I'm working from home, so I'm still just kind of chugging away at life. Uh, oh, my job is wasn't considered essential, so I'm just at home till this is till this blows over. So I'm not doing anything. And what do you do for work? Thoroughly enjoying it. This is much needed. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. I really needed to do nothing for. Lord. Perfect. <laughs> He's ran D and D twice this week and Monster of the Week once. So. Okay. Nice. That's that's all we're doing. I got nothing like special to plug, you know, just survive, guys. <laughs> oh, word. All right. Mr. Mandrill, what do you what would you like to plug on your way out here? Mr. Mandrill. You should guys join us on uh, Call of Duty World War Two because a whole bunch of us have been playing zombies at my um... uh, brother's apartment. I don't support oh, okay. Call of Duty, but I feel like I should get it just so I can play with y'all even though it sucks. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be involved. Practice. <laughs> oh god, I just realized. That and the I'll camera throw it in the Discord, but spam my brother's uh, Xbox account with uh, friend invites. <laughs> friend invites. Okay. I got you. I can do that. <laughs> That's like it, it plays across all platforms too, even in um, the zombie. Uh, I don't know if World War Two does that. No, I don't think that I one know. does. Oh, damn, well, light. count me out. <laughs> Ooh, excuse me, that was a nasty bird. <laughs> I apologize Thanks, for that one. <laughs> Alright, Christian, you're up. Oh, man, I'm up. Uh, dang, I didn't think this through. But, I'm gonna try to wing it. So, basically, everyone... As I say this goodbye, stay safe, stay away from people, six feet apart, only go out when you need to. I just want everyone to be okay and start shooting each other again when eye combat opens. It'll be fun. Uh, look out for my YouTube video tomorrow. It's going to be out. Yay! Is it a gaming vid this time? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm, on, I'm back on my Call of Duty. Awesome, hey. awesome, awesome. <laughs> All right, Bird, what you got? Um, I don't have a ton to say because I'm not doing that much right now. <laughs> because quarantine has your girl, again, binging Netflix like a motherfucker. <laughs> but, um, you know, I love y'all. I love this community. Just like everybody else is saying, stay safe. Take care of yourselves. Take your vitamins. Get enough sleep. And, like, you know, if you're going to go outside, fine. Just make sure you're being careful. Wash up when you get inside. Take your walks. Go for a run. You know, do whatever self-care is for you. But, like, first and foremost, take care of yourself. Do what you need to do to get through all of this and however long that it takes. And, again, I love y'all. And I hope you enjoyed today's podcast. Yay. All right. I don't have much else to say. I'm still working. I've got nothing coming up this week. I will be playing Warzone as much as I can. You can always check me in the Discord. I'm always looking for people to play with. Um, we got this podcast going up tomorrow, 1 o'clock again, for the people that uh, don't get to see it normally. Uh, as long as I combat stays closed, I think we're going to keep this uh, community podcasting going. This was a lot of fun tonight. I so, love it. <laughs> um, yeah, that's pretty much all I got. Um, time for me to do my cheesy thing, isn't it? <laughs> I think so. Although oh, it's yeah. not really fun now because no one's really playing. But um, so so everyone, be safe, be smart. Uh, we'll get through this together. Uh, don't do stupid shit. There's people out there that can't help themselves, so you need to help them. Uh, remember that gear is wet because we sanitize it for you. It's not because the person before you was a, a sweaty mess. Okay. <laughs>
Yeah, it couldn't be that. It couldn't be that at all. But, you know, if, you're, if your gear isn't working and you think something's wrong, it probably is. Head over to ICE, get yourself a gear swap. We will see you guys next Wednesday at 9.30, 9 o'clock for the pre-show. We love you all. Have a great week. And this week's outro is going to be a beautiful rendition from one of my favorite video games. Portal. Portal. Oh! <laughs> stay alive, everybody. We'll see you next week. It's a fun game. Bye, y'all. Stay healthy. <laughs> Bye.